This video is an introduction to hip precautions. Hip precautions are put into place to avoid increased pressure in the area of healing tissues as well as to avoid the potential for hip dislocation after surgery. Hip precautions and surgical approach are labeled by the area of incision and the technique used to enter the joint during surgery. Posterior applies to the back side of the joint, anterior applies to the front, and lateral applies to the side. You may also hear anterior lateral or posterior lateral. We are going to divide these videos up into three different sections, anterior, posterior, and lateral, and then we will discuss the most common hip precautions for each section. Surgeries and hip precautions can vary, so we want you to consult with your physician and physical therapist on the hip precautions that apply to you and any other special instructions so that you're viewing the appropriate video and or videos. In general, after hip surgery, no matter what hip precautions you are under, we recommend that you have a good place to sit, preferably with armrests, so that you can assist your good leg with your arms and pushing yourself up safely after surgery. We don't want you sitting in any surface that puts your hips below your knees. This also applies to the bathroom, so you need to check the toilet height, as well as the push-off surfaces that you will be assisting yourself in getting up off the toilet. Toilet paper holders, towel bars, Pedestal sinks and sinks that are anchored directly to the wall that do not have a base are not appropriate or safe push-off areas. So again, make sure that you're consulting with your physician on the hip precautions that apply to you, and then get started below in viewing the appropriate video and or videos.